Chapter 14 remains. The changing of the gods in heaven was well underway as I arrived to the edge of the clearing within shouting distance of that plain. As the obeyed of morning announced the sky, the moon was not given the luxury of descent. Instead, bullied by the fat fingers of dawn, it merely opaqued. Upon sight of that craft in the meadow's midst, my heart grew wild with the promise of some fellow traveler in the jungle morass. There upon one knee, my senses then toggled so that my sight was fully deployed upon the meadow. I would discover that more curious than that great rent in the jungle's canopy, which could be explained by the crash, was the dull and dominant color of beige, nature's unique stamp upon half-life. Unlike the vitality of the world I'd known that far, the prairie was a study in atrophy, where the absence of water and the punishment of light worked together to form a wasteland there.